Greetings, folks, and welcome to Vinyl Therapy Sessions, the Jujutsu Kaisen Summer 2022 Funko Pop set. Now, it took me a while to say this because it also took me a while to gather these things. I wasn't sure what was what. I have a whole bunch of Jujutsu Kaisen uh, pop pops that I was picking up in piecemeal. And it, it didn't seem to make sense to the sequence, right? So it, it, it made it hard for me to do the video. You'll understand when I do the, you know, when I do the next videos for these things. But let's start, you know, I'm going to go with the original five back. And the five back are the original five characters here. Uh, one, yeah, Yuji, Megumi, Nobara, Satoru, and Mahito. You're like, well, what is this guy doing here? <laughs> He's number 117. And the reason why I added him here instead of the one, you know, the 116 is because the 116 is a 12, uh, not 12, a 6-incher. Kind of too big. And I had to choose whether I wanted the glow or not the glow. And I think in this case, I may want the glow, right? I, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm indecisive in, in this matter. I may end up with both. Either way, I'm going to do a whole video on that one separately but here we go this is what the fye exclusive yuji itadori is with the Tsuk tsukamoto doll uh, the doll that punches him in the face and he, you know in the in the show and he loses concentration it's kind of cool <laughs> but not you know <laughs> yeah i did get him out of the way because he's the one that's out of control you know <laughs> i had to get him out of the way because you know like i said he's just he's just that pop with with uh it doesn't seem to match because of his horizontal state. All right, next we got Yuji Itadori, the regular. Okay, I'm going to have to bring the light. Just give me the light. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, my gosh, I came ill-prepared. I was thinking that the light was good until I noticed that it wasn't, and I'm like, uh Jeebus, Jeebus, Jeebus. Oh, I'm... I apologize, team. All right, here we go. Yuji Itadori, one, 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 one. He's the first one of the set of five. Yeah, here's what it looks like in package. The next half of the show is going to be them out of package. It's going to be spectacular. <laughs> um, yeah, at least I think it will. <laughs> See. <laughs> yeah, one eleven. And next, Megumi Fushiguro, one twelve with his uh divine dog and he's got the right hand st stance for it it's really cool his jutsu or spell thing kind of cool this is a great show you guys got to watch it this anime is actually pretty gosh dang cool but yeah he's got his pet dog well pet summoned animal <clears throat> and nobara kugisaki now these three, the first three, are a class. They're, I guess that's the equivalent of Naruto. Um, uh, oh my gosh. I, Sasuke and uh, Sakura team up, kind of. You know what I mean? And yeah, with Yuji Itadori being the talented but unrefined, not knowing anything about anything of this character so far. So he's learning. He's raw. He's got a lot of potential, but he's also been possessed by, uh, well, yeah, this one, one of the strongest demons. So he's either the protagonist and antagonist at the same time, while this guy could be the protagonist since he's the Kakashi slash ultimate badass of the show. He's very powerful and was also friends with the antagonist of the show, uh, Suguru Geto and Mahito. Or no, not Mahito, but Suguru Geto. They were classmates until they there weren't all of a sudden they have yet to explain that in the portion of the anime that i'm at i've only watched season one part one and yeah this is what it looks like in package not bad this package kind of may have to get a one with a better thing i didn't inspect this too well when i bought it i'm forgetting it uh next mahito uh one of the antagonists he's a demonish kind of character with scars on his face and yeah he's a pretty scary guy um yeah he's out to get these guys and anyone else who's pretty much in the in that school 
But yeah. All right, folks, the next part will be the open sequence coming up next. And this is what they look like outside of the package. Yeah, they look pretty good. This is a great looking set. Um, man, it looks great outside of the package. Uh, so here they are. Uh, here's a closer look. It's our main character, Yuji Itadori. Um, he's got his attack. Punch the heck out of some with his magic technique. Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah, he's one of the new students. He's just trying to learn. But he's got a lot of potential. And then here's Megumi Kushiguro. Yeah, he's very unstable. So you got to be real careful. At least mine's is. Yeah, he would have benefited from having one of the stands. Like um, Yuji Itadori. You're about to fall on his own if you, uh, you know. And he's got the hand, the dog technique down with his hands. It's pretty cool. Very accurate to the anime slash manga, but anime in this case. All right. Next up, <clears throat> Nobara Kogisake with her hammer and nails. That's her technique. She when when she hammers and nails the the demons and spirits and such. Uh, her pop's kind of plain, but you know this is more for the character than anything, you know. So, and she has a stand too because yeah, she can't stand on her own. <laughs> Magumi's getting his buns kicked by gravity. Next up, the other hero of the show, the most powerful guy, the Kakashi yes character. Um, Satoru Gojo. Yeah. He's probably the most powerful guy. And the way that this, you know, he, I think he's also probably the most good looking out of the bunch too. The way they try to play him. But yeah, he's the most powerful guy in their class. He's also good friends with one of the antagonists, Suguru Ghetto, which I did a video of earlier with the set all right next up mahito another antagonist who's working in coins you know with us uh, suguru ghetto ghetto look at that look at that gray hair <laughs> like a three ponytail thing going on yeah he's got pretty scarred up face powers and everything he, he although he looks human i think he's more of a demon than or evil spirit than anything uh and last but not least yuji itadori in his uh sleep gear with the golem and he has a stand too because if he doesn't he'll fall down and yeah, the golem's with him because in the scene in the anime, <laughs> it helps him to concentrate. He's, he's regulated to watching movies to practice and concentrate on his feet, you know, focusing on his feelings. Because once he loses focus, uh, the golem's going to come up with the boxing gloves and punch him in the face. So it's pretty funny. <laughs> pretty brutal. But yeah. All right, folks. Um, final thoughts on this set. This thing looked great as a set outside of the box and inside of the box, right? Inside of the package. Um, I I really like the anime. I hope to see more. I can't. I haven't watched season one, part two yet because it's still too expensive. It was on sale. They only sold the first half on sale. At some point, I'm going to pick it up. But you know, waiting for the price to be right. Right, folks. Um, yeah, the the show is really good. You guys really should watch it. Um, from my understanding, season two is coming out soon, and yeah, it'd be a good idea to catch up on it so I can, you know, get in preparation for when season two comes out. All right, folks. That's all I got for this segment of Vinyl Therapy Sessions, the Jujutsu Kaisen uh, Summer Twenty Twenty Two Funko Pop set. I am your host, Coco Smooth, and until the next video, folks, ciao.